Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta, Learn Form Validation by Building a Calorie Counter, Step 74. All right. So our Get Calories from Inputs function will set the global error flag to true if an invalid input is detected. All right. So, yeah, this is what's going to happen right here. Uh, we're going to add an if statement to our calculate calories function that checks the truthiness of our global error flag. And if it is truthy, then we're going to use return to end the function execution. Okay. So what we're doing here is we're just going to say if, and then we're going to get this thing right here. If this is true. All right. So we'll just put it right there. Cause if it's false, uh, whether it's true or false, it's going to know just by doing that. And then what we're going to do is just something weird. We're going to say return. I've literally, this is the first time I've ever seen return used this way. Uh, so, you know, new stuff on uh, free code camp, right? Let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 75. And we'll see you next time.